In any city, in any country, go to any apartment complex you can get yourself into. When you reach the front desk, ask if you can see someone who calls himself the holder of isolation. If there is no front desk, use the buzzer and request to look at the 26th room for sale, which will prompt a doorman to appear. In either scenario, the worker should lead you down a flight of stairs that wasn't previously there. Soon you will arrive at a door, and the employee will open it for you. Do not enter just yet, rather look into the opened door. Ask for the worker to close the door and leave you alone. If he insists that you enter, you have two choices, to wait for the worker to reveal his true form, or to step into the door and feed yourself to the horrors that lie within. Either way, your journey ends here. If the worker obliges you, wait for him to be out of sight. Be certain you are alone before you open that door. Beyond that door will be a gathering in a high-rise apartment overlooking the capital city of whatever region you are in. You will notice that everyone who you love and cherish will be present in that room. Friends, family, and loved ones will all greet you with loving and open arms. Talk to them as if they were the real thing. Laugh with them. Reminisce with them. Treat them with respect, and you will be treated in kind. Doing any less will result in a punishment far worse than any mortal could conceive of. One by one, the guests will start excusing themselves, saying that they have somewhere else to go. Do not stop them for anything, as they have obliged you enough already. Slowly the room will drain of people, and before long the only ones left will be you and the person that you love most. Cherish the time given to you, as they too will eventually depart and you need to muster every ounce of mental strength for the coming trial. Even though this Fakade is not real, it knows enough to effectively emulate its real-world counterpart. Here you can say anything you would like to confess to them, but ensure that you give them the proper respect. When they make a motion to leave, let them. There is no turning back now. As soon as they close the door, everything will slowly turn black. You are free to do anything here, shout, panic, or stay calm. It is your choice. Once everything has faded away, there is nothing to be done but wait. You will spend what feels like weeks, months, or even years here in this darkness. You will start missing the people that were surrounding you earlier and will long to feel their warmth and hear their laughter again. You felt that you belonged when you were with them, but now you're alone to fend for yourself in this darkness. You will start looking for someone, anyone, to accompany you in this trying time, but only darkness greets you in any direction. You will feel no hunger, no thirst, but you will feel the energy drain from you with every second. This realm will not allow you to sleep, and even if you try, you will be unable to find slumber to temporarily relieve you of your loneliness. Many before you who could not bear this feeling are all a part of this darkness now, and want nothing more than for you to join them, though their wishes will never be granted. Again, you are free to do anything here, though ending your own life now, will only leave you in that darkness forever with those before you. Steal yourself and eventually you will see a point of light on the horizon, which provides a shocking contrast to the bleak world in which you have been existing. As soon as you see it, close your eyes and ask, is this how they feel? Wait for approximately three minutes before you open your eyes. If the light is gone and darkness surrounds you again, sit down and relax. Your journey is over, and this darkness is now your home for all eternity. If you are lucky, when you open your eyes, you will be outside of the apartment complex. 
At your feet will be a picture frame, and inside of it, a picture of you and the person you love engaged in a warm embrace in the apartment. Do not let anyone see it, though. They will certainly wonder about the origin of that picture. The picture and frame are Object 126 of 538. You have felt their pain. Now you must end their suffering.